Right, good evening, good evening everybody. We've had a couple of technical problems this, uh, this evening. So this is the Planning Committee on the 16th of January 2024. I'd like to welcome everybody and remind members that the meeting has been recorded and will be uploaded to YouTube. So far I've got apologies from councillors Danny Cook, Jason Jones and Paul Thompson. Do I have any other apologies? No, okay. Moving on, the num item number two, minutes of the previous meeting. The committee are looking to approve the minutes of the meeting held on the 5th of December 2023. Can I ask for a mover and a seconder? Don't know who that was first. Uh, so I think it was Co Councillor Adams and oh, Councillor Adams and Councillor Coates. Yeah. Okay, so that's oh, need to go to the vote. Sorry. So can I have a vote on all those in favour? Thank you. That's passed. Uh, item number three: declarations of interest. Does anybody have a, an interest that they need to declare? No. Okay. So item number four is the application for consideration, which is zero two eight nine. 2023, which is 5 Coal Hill, Tamworth. So I'm going to hand over to the planning officer. Thank you, Chair. Um, this application is for works to uh, a tree in a conservation area, reference 0289 2023. Uh, the tree is located um, at 5 Coal Hill, which is the old um, co-op building. Um, this application is um, come to committee uh, because it's part of the wider developments uh, for the future high streets work uh, that are ongoing at the moment. Um, all trees in a conservation area, conservation areas are protected and if, um, if works are proposed then they have to notify us and we have a six week period to deal with this, this type of application. Um, this particular tree, it's not proposed to remove the tree, it's proposed to trim the tree in the form of a crown reduction um, and this is to facilitate the reno renovation of the former cart building in order that they can create enough space to put up their scaffolding. It's a Rabinia tree, uh, this particular tree. Um, so the tree will be pruned back to suitable growth points in order to retrieve a three metre space between the nearest part of the tree and the building. The works are actually being carried out on behalf of Tamworth Borough Council and the tree actually belongs to Staffordshire County Council. <clears throat> when we first received this application, there was the suggestion that the tree could be removed. Um, or it was, they were, there was a request as to whether they could remove the tree. Um, we consulted the tree officer and the tree officer said um, that his preference would be for the, the tree to be pruned instead of it being removed. So we've had amended details for the application to say that um, it's just to be pruned, not to be removed. So we've got a picture of the tree on the screen and... Um, uh, the oval is illustrating um, how, how to, how, to what extent they want to trim the tree, and we've also got a plan. Have we got a plan? And the plan shows um, the location of the tree on on Coal Hill. So, as I said, the tree officer initially said he wasn't he wasn't over the, um, he wasn't in support of removing the tree. So uh, we had amit, um, amended details submitted, and the tree officer was consulted. And his response to the second round of consultation was that so long as the tree was left balanced and pruned to um, appropriate British standards, um, the proposed works, in his view, were acceptable. So the considerations for this application are the amenity value of the tree. Um, the tree isn't just in the town centre, it's in the town centre conservation area. 
uh, and it makes and it does make a positive contribution to the character and appearance in this location of the town centre and the conservation area. Um, it's proposed to just prune the tree back, not to remove the tree, and the work will be undertaken by an experienced arbicultural, arbicultural association, association approved contractor. Uh, we, we've taken the view that as the Rabina tree will be retained and the proposed works maintain the appearance of the tree, uh, albeit to a lesser scale, the contribution to the character will not be significantly impacted and therefore we're recommending that the works be allowed. It's proposed the works, um, the scaffolding, sorry, that they're proposing to put up will be there for about eight months. And that's, that's the prediction at the moment. Um, that's it. That's it, really. Thank you. Right. Does the committee have any questions for the planning officer, Councillor Woodrop? Yeah, just a quick one. How fast does the tree grow? And is there a certain time of the year that you would have to cut it so it doesn't die? I don't know because I'm not a gardener, so I'm just asking the question. I don't know the answer to how fast the tree grows, I'm afraid. Um, the tree officer might know uh, the answer to that question, um, but I don't know. Um, as for the appropriate times of the year to trim it, um, I mean, obviously, they've, they've told us that they'll be, a rec they'll be using specialists in order to do the work. And um, I'm sure if, if there was an issue there that, you know, that they'd, they'd be advised in, in accordingly, really. Answer, yeah. Any other questions? No? Shall we move to debate? Anybody want to debate? I'll come to the chair's rescue. Thank you, uh, Chair. So, um, for me, yeah, obviously, this is a bit of a no brainer. I understand why it's got to come to committee, so I'll be supporting this and and, and looking for a se uh, second. Uh, the, uh, the only point I would raise is that um, I hope that. Um, the work is going to be carried out before March. Well, that's when bird nesting season usually kicks in between March and October. So uh, it's usually when we uh, when we try and uh, not cut cut down trees due to bird nesting. But if it does go into March, that obviously the, the necessary precautions are taken into place with uh, the monitoring of the tree to make sure no, no nothing's nesting in there. Anybody else? Okay, does anybody want to second the motion? Okay. Councillor Claymore. Debating. Anybody else? Clear. Any other debate or no? Should we just move to the vote? Yeah. Okay, so um, the committee agree not to make a tree preservation order and confirm the works go ahead. So all those in favour? So that's unanimous, that's passed. So thank you everybody, that concludes the business of the meeting and I close the meeting at 11 minutes past six, thank you.